What's up guys, welcome to Apex. Thanks for tuning in. Meta has been adding some brilliant features on WhatsApp application and we have seen most of those new features in the past. I've already posted a few videos on those features. In this video, let's take a look at some brand new features which have arrived on the WhatsApp application. This is the beta version that I'm using currently. So all these features have arrived on beta and on the stable version, some of them have already arrived and maybe in the next few days, Meta will make it available for the stable version as well. Now let's go ahead and take a look at all these new features. Now let me go ahead and open WhatsApp. You can see this is a brand new layout which was introduced in the recent past on WhatsApp beta and this has also arrived on the stable version of WhatsApp. You can see uh, the uh, menus are at the bottom now. The navigation is very easy with one hand. Now using one hand we will be able to go through all these menus. You can tap on updates, communities, calls and chats right from here at the bottom. Uh, we don't really have to hold the phone in one hand and uh, go to the top to select all these menu options options we have got all of them at the bottom right here and you can also see we have got brand new icon colors now uh, this green is slightly different on this icon let me just tap on uh, uh, the chat here you can see the background of these chats are also in dark green now the color is slightly different you can see this icon here the green color is much more pronounced now and then when we select a particular chat you see all these icons on the top here even they have been revamped they look much better now these are some new icons which uh, Meta has added on WhatsApp now. Now moving on to the second feature, if you remember uh, Meta introduced a chat lock for particular individual chats on WhatsApp, which we were able to do it by getting into the chat and tapping on the profile and then going into uh, the menu options here where we have got chat lock at the bottom. Uh, we could enable the lock by uh, getting into this menu. But now what Meta has done is we can directly lock a particular chat from the chat list itself. I can just press and hold on a particular chat and tap on this uh, three dot button and here we have got the option lock chat so it has become very easy now it's more intuitive to lock a particular chat just select any chat you want tap on the three dot button you will get lock chat option just tap on lock chat and it gets locked it will require the authentication of course uh, now the chat has been locked uh, we can just swipe down to see the lock chat now the next important feature is Passkey. Now passkeys have been added for WhatsApp for easier authentication whenever you uh, shift your phone or whenever you log into your WhatsApp account on another device. It becomes very easy now. Let me show you where exactly this is. Let me tap on the three dot button. I'll go to settings. Now here I will go to uh, accounts. On the top we have got this all new option passkey. Let me just tap on this. It says a simple way to sign in safely. You can now use your fingerprint face or screen lock to verify if it's you with a passkey. Your passkey are safely stored in a password manager. So we can create a passkey now. Let me just tap on create a passkey. Here it says passkeys are safer, easier way to sign into applications and websites without remembering complex passwords. Instead, you can use your biometrics or screen lock to sign in. So it's self-explanatory. It's very easy to use passkeys to log into your account on any device quickly in a jiffy. Now let me just tap on continue. It says create a passkey for WhatsApp and save it to Samsung Pass. Uh, if you are using Samsung phones, you can save this passkey on Samsung Pass or maybe if you are using some other phone, it might get saved on a Google account. Now let me just tap on create. I can just create a passkey here. I'll tap on done. I'll tap on continue. Now the passkey has been created on a Samsung Pass. I will just use my fingerprint to unlock this. You can see it is showing me the passkey right here this will be used to verify your account now i can revoke this if i don't want this passkey and i can keep it as long as i want to easily uh, unlock the whatsapp or uh, log into the whatsapp on the phone that is another brand new feature which meta has added now moving on we've got some new privacy feature whenever you are sending an audio message to someone you can make it view once so that the receiver will view that or hear that audio message once and it gets disappeared. That's a brand new feature. Let me just show you how it works. Let me tap on uh, one of the chats here. I will create an audio message. You can see the audio message is being created here. And on the right hand side, I have got this icon view once. I can tap on this to make this message set as view once. Now I can just send this message. Now this message will be viewed once by the receiver and that will disappear once it is viewed. 
another change we have got is now we do not have the uh, quick video messages uh, earlier we could tap on this audio icon here uh, to uh, get into the video message icon now it seems like whatsapp has removed the instant video messages uh, we cannot really create a video message and send it uh, i did discuss this uh, feature in one of my previous videos and now it seems to have disappeared and uh, uh, we do not have that encrypted uh, video messages which can be created on the chat now we just have the audio message now now apart from these features we also got another privacy feature we can now hide ip address on video calls let me show you where exactly this uh, setting is i'll tap on this three dot button and go to settings i'll tap on privacy at the bottom you see you got an option called advanced i can tap on this here it says protect ip address in call to make it harder for people to info your location calls on this device will be securely relayed through whatsapp servers this will reduce call quality so if you enable this you will lose the call quality but uh, the calls will be more private and secure so if you want to enable it you can go ahead and do that another new feature is now when you go to updates we get to see all these status and channel information here and uh, now we have got this search button by tapping on which we'll be able to search a particular channel on this page so that is a new feature which have been added these are some of the brand new features which have been added on the beta version of whatsapp and uh, some of these features might have already arrived on the stable version so you can go ahead and check out your whatsapp application if you haven't registered to beta you may not be able to do that now because the beta program has been closed for whatsapp however the new features have been arriving on the stable version also very quickly so uh, most of these features should be available on your phone now apart from all these new features we also have one more new feature expected that is uh, searching the chats by date we are going to get some filters to search the chat by date that's going to be very useful to search any particular content on the whatsapp application any particular chat if you want to search it can be sorted by dates that's going to be amazing that's about it these are some brand new features which have arrived on the uh, beta version of whatsapp and some of them have also arrived on the stable version go ahead and check it out and let me know your thoughts about these new features in the comment section below that's all i want to share with you guys if you haven't subscribed to the channel already go ahead hit the subscribe button and become a part of apex community community to know your phone better and give this video a like if you find this video useful thanks for watching my name is salyan signing off cheers bye bye